Hey guys, this is just gonna be a pre-update before I place my stuff. Look at this beautiful gold hammer I got. I couldn't resist it. It's gorgeous. Now it's not fully open. I put it in here about an hour ago. It's just insane. I'm gonna remove that green hammer and put it there. So this one, look at that. Put it there and then that one I'm gonna put like over here on the side of that rock. Then I got this beautiful torch. Um, now you guys know these are my favorite torches and just look at them, they're stunning. This here is a green and purplish fluorescent torch. It's just been put in the tank. It is a smaller torch, but it'll open up probably three times that size. And that one is gonna get glued up between the two or something. These two are cool looking, but they have no color to them. So I'll eventually get rid of them so I can put something else in my sand. Um, I just dosed my chemical with Brightwell E, it's like phosphate remover, and look what it did. It closed all these zoanthids and it closed all my yellow ones. Every single, the same one is closed. And it closed a couple on there, but all the rest are fine. Everything else looks good. Uh, this thing here, the Leptostrea, it's growing under the rock now. It's actually going under the side. It's pretty cool. So all I wanted to introduce was my new hammerhead and this one, my new torch. I will give an update once I get bigger. My frog spawn is dying, don't know why. Uh, it's back down to the original size when I got it. And in the center of it, it's all shriveled up and the fluorescents are falling out of it, little particles. Don't know why, that thing has been one of my favorite pieces in the tank ever. Um, it's my first piece of coral and it got so big it was touching the sand and now look at it it's tiny i don't know what's wrong with it but here's a little quick rundown ugani's not that open because i moved them around my pallies here i had to remove the sponges and i got some black spots on the top of the pallies now which is due to probably dipping them the pally next to it on the left, the orange one, isn't as orange as it looks. It should be brighter than that. The one above it, which has almost no color, that is a vampire pally. They're supposed to be beautiful, but it's got no color, but it is growing. A second head and a third head. Um, this thing is doing great. And all my stuff in the back is doing amazing. Amazing. Uh, just look at it all. See if I can zoom in. All those are just generating tons of more pallies or zoanthids. This thing just gets so big in the day. That's SPS, I'm looking to get rid of it. And this coral, the Acan, see these are Acan Lords. This one and the green one there in the corner. This one is the other version, which kills the others. So I had to separate them. All right, I wanted to keep this short and sweet as much as I could, and I'll do another update. Also, my hammer, I, what's it called? These guys here, frog spawn, there's a new head growing inside the front. I know you can see a little bit of one, but there's actually another one. All right, and my orange zoanthids, look how pretty they're coming out. They finally started to blossom. I'm just so excited. All these zoanthids are starting to pop. All right, that's it. You guys have a good day.